Hello guys. What you're looking at right now is a snail. Yes, a snail. Mm, it's an African snail. Anyway, snail is snail. But because this one is in Africa, I tagged it African snail. Do you know the size of the shell reflects its age? You can see how small this one is. It's looking small, so it's definitely telling us that it's a small snail, so its age will not be as big as the, or will not be as old as the big ones. Mm -hmm. And it loves watery side, it likes staying in watery ground, it likes staying where water is, slimy areas. You can see the ground of this place is slimy, is um, slippery. You can see spirogyra on the ground, meaning that <laughs> men, if you're not careful and you're walking there, you can easily fall, and that's where they like staying. They are members of the phylum mollusca class Gastropoda. Yeah, we know all that. And you see this shell. This shell is his house. I mean, it's where it stays. It cannot do without the shell. I think it's even attached to the shell because it gives it its protection. If someone should touch it now, it will run inside. You see something dangerous coming, it runs inside to, to get itself safe, protected. And many more. You can see how long the body is when it extends or projects its body out of the shell. Its tentacles are well projected and it's so long. Mm -hmm. I think it's moving its body around, searching for what? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's searching for food or something. It's lying flat. Mm -hmm. uh, see? I can see how they behave. Hmm. Quite interesting. Um, hmm. I'm going to touch it to see how it responds. If it quickly moves its body inside, or it will just stay. And just to know how it responds to its environment. Danger and the rest. Go inside. Go inside. Hmm. Enter. Enter. Enter inside your house now. Just went inside a little. It's quite stubborn, I guess. But I'll try something else. Let me see if it goes inside. Let me touch it again and see it go inside. I just wanted to go inside. Let me be sure what I'm saying here. Go inside. Go. Okay. So molluscas can be slow, but snail is not that slow. I think slow is slower. It took the snail 15 minutes to get up to the level that it is now, so it's quite fast. Snail speed should be around. 0.047 km per hour. I'm going to see how it will react to danger. I'll pour it some water. It just fell down. I threw it on the ground. Wow. You can see it has pushed some part of its body inside, inside the shell to protect itself from danger. <laughs> I think it was scared. So it was a little bit scared, so it went inside a little. It lost sticky nature to the wall and it's able to fall down. Wow. 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 You can see it's coming out again. It's still moving around. That is strong. The shell actually protected it from harm, so it didn't wound itself or anything. I'll uh, pour water on it to see it turns aside again <laughs> to confirm just to know how it reacts to water covering it. It's not bad for it actually, but uh, it tends to stay up so that it doesn't get suffocated. 
it's kind of see it eh? you know it's it's living it's not like it's there so it needs to put yeah mm. so this mm. let's see just watch this can you see you see confirmed confirmed yeah it's run inside very fast to make sure that it's safe from any danger so it's actually thinking it was being attacked or something so maybe it's run inside out of here so it's it's shelled really it's home it's protector so i will quickly remove it from there so it can continue with its life okay guys thank you thank you thanks for watching we've seen how african snail reacts to danger its habitats its movements and everything but taking but in its its life um i learned something today i don't know if you did well if you did please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and wait for more videos